Hope you're all still awake. Late Night Mega here. Yep, thank you. Perfect timing to get up there, Alex. Hmm, yeah, we've seen that dream before. Well, we live in a magical land, Alex. Plus, this is a JRPG, so they wouldn't be bringing this up over and over if it didn't actually mean something. I don't know how, how Alex could sleep well sleeping on the floor like that. All right. Now to go see Galleon. That guy's still laying there. Excellent. Well, I don't know if that's excellent. Alright, here we are at the harbor. And here I am, lost at the harbor. Have I ever talked to these people before? Well, not everyone is evil. Uh, because we are? Yeah, we know that. We're traveling with him. I... I'm not going to comment on that. Okay, let's go. Galleon, it's time to go. Yes. Yep, we're we're ready. At first I read that as let us go waste another moment. <laughs> and I was confused. Oh, it's gonna be one of those videos. A very fair question. Alex, it's time for character development. Alex. Hmm. Well, that's a nice, noble, yep, noble reason. Thank you, Galleon. Uh, yeah, go for it. It is character development time. Ooh. That's a thought-provoking question. Yeah, you'd have to, um, we need a little bit more context for that deep of a question. I mean, like, for instance, why can't it be both? Well, we're 25% of the way there. Okay, uh, no, we're not back in control. Yeah, she's got quite some talent.
Weren't you kind of already hearing her sing at the top of that crystal tower? I mean, granted, she was, like, forced singing. So, I could understand maybe you'd want to hear it for real. Well, we're not quite home yet. We have some woods to go through. Havel. Again, I like the descriptive words they use in this game. And Galleon's walking with us, and Galleon is actually in our party. That's so cool. Oh, I love this part. Let's look at his equipment. We, we can't do that. Okay, well, let's look at his magic. Tornado. All enemies. He has 500 MP, and that thing only costs 10. Rock and roll. Rock and roll, really? That only costs 10. Nitro Dagger. That costs 14. And Inferno costs 14. Huh, well, we'll have to try them out. And he's level 99. Oh, that's crazy. Well, he is one of the uh, four heroes, so this makes sense. All right, there was no need to fill up there. Um, I'm going to... Oh, I mean, I guess there is some uh, dialogue here, but uh, I'm not going to dig too deeply into that. Most of it is just kind of like plot-related. Well, I don't want to say plot-related, but just... Uh, Dialogue you'd typically expect out of RPG NPCs. LMNOP. Alright. I never re equipped Alex. Well, at least this blunder is happening here. Aluna's not equipped either. I, you know what? It doesn't matter. Um, Inferno. Oh my. Well, that's insanity. <laughs> Dang. <laughs> Dealing nearly 500 damage to everyone. Oh, I love it. You know this isn't going to last, viewers. You, you know he's only a temporary party member. Um, yeah, let's equip stuff. Please. Actually, wait a minute. You had a bow. What happened to your bow? Whatever. Actually, I'm not going to equip you. Because I don't want you having the rod anyways. Rawr! Okay, well, let's try, uh... I'm going to show off all of Galleon's spells, because this is just fun. Uh, what those two don't matter, do don't matter, because he's obviously going to be faster. There's Nitro Dagger. That's a cool-looking attack. Not as strong as Inferno. Not as lengthy as Inferno, either. Yeah, the game's not going to let us keep someone like Galleon in our party forever. As cool as that would be, giving you a level 99 character like this it will just break the game. Tornado! Oh, this is fun. I guess that guy was weak to wind. Oh, we got an antidote. And we just have one more to show off. I 
Oh yeah, those guys were probably weak to fire. That's why that uh, Inferno did so much. There's rock and roll. Dang. But yeah, I'm sure Galleon's going to... It's going to be some sort of cheesy uh, JRPG plot where Galleon's going to be like, well, I have to let you have your own adventures and let you go out and become a Dragon Master because I'm too old or whatnot. I like Nitro Dagger. It's kind of hypnotic. I probably won't use Inferno that much just because it's such a long animation. Okay, you guys are not a challenge. I don't I don't know if you've realized this or not, but you're not a challenge. <laughs> tornado. That's, that's funny. I like the tornado, how they pulled that off. Where it just takes the characters and sucks them in and spins them around. Oh, you gotta do this stuff. It's just fun. Besides, there's no danger. I mean, even if there is danger... Look at all the spells we can spam with Galleon. Oh, Luna's gaining a level. Okay. Didn't expect anyone to gain off a level. Gain, gain off a level. Gain a level off of the uh, now minuscule experience that we're getting from these guys. But whatever. Ah, uh, nitro dagger. I should try like a basic attack. Oh, well, we do have to travel through the white dragon cave, so we can do basic attacks there too. Uh, oh, yeah, we just have to keep heading to the right here. Head to the uh, down and right, and you'll eventually get out of this place. The Weird Woods. Not so weird anymore. Um, oh yeah, we're trying basic attack. Dang! Dang! Okay, you only get two attacks. And that puts things in perspective. <laughs> Yes, level 99 mage physical attack is uh, a lot stronger than our level 18 swordsman. Who would have guessed? And we'll stop in at Berg. Plus, don't I have to... Uh... Galleon does want to hear Luna sing. wonder if we should just take him to that spring. Is that what we're supposed to do? Yes, we are. Uh, interesting thoughts, Luna? Well, thank you for the, uh, nice words, Luna. Yes, we have more ahead of us, of course. We have to complete uh, our quest to become a Dragon Master and stop the Vile Tribe.
Uh, what about singing? You're supposed to sing. Galleon is waiting for you to sing. I... It... I'm... I'm confused. Well, maybe we'll go to, uh... Dine's Monument. Galleon might want to see that, too. Let's show Galleon off to our parents. That sounds weird. Dad, look, I brought Galleon. Yeah, we are. <laughs> but no, we're not dying reincarnated. Don't uh and don't get that idea in your head viewers. <laughs> How are we going to do that, Mom? I mean, there are no cell phones in this game. Um... Uh, what are you even saying? Oh, unite the world, okay. Still, I mean, I realize it might not be up to uh, par for a monument that you might have been expecting with something elaborate. I mean, look at the way you dress. You're quite fancy. No reason to be so harsh. Okay, let's go to the White Dragon Cave. Uh, Alex walking back and forth when he's walking up. That looks, that looks kind of funny. Actually, it looks kind of funny with all of them. Alright, Galleon, think you can handle the enemies in here? Yeah, I do too. Okay, just one last time, we'll show off the uh, Inferno. Giant fireball out of the sky, and then other fireballs out of the sky. And, spoiler alert, uh, the four spells that Galleon has are not spells that your characters ever get to learn, ever. It's disappointing, I know. But that's why I'm showing them off now. Nitro Dagger! Totally not necessary. I wonder if Galleon can gain a level. Let's check his status. Uh, no, he cannot. No, he cannot. Oh, well, that does give us some insight into his... Oh, Wind Cane. I wonder if I can use that as an item in battle. We'll try that. Uh, battle, battle. Thank you. Prevents... Oh, Tri Ring prevents status change. Rainbow Band... Knit with knowledge. It's not conjuring gusts. Fine, we'll just conjure gusts of my own. 
<laughs> I like the flies there. Yeah, run away. Oh, did we just escape one of those flies? It is possible. It's just quite challenging to do so. Ah, uh, rock and roll time. This is some pretty strong magic. I like it. Oh, can we have a boss battle with Galleon in our party? That would be so fun. I mean, we'd utterly destroy whatever boss it is, but it'd be fun. Oh, the albino baboon. We'll put him on ice. No, he resists ice. I don't care. <laughs> and Galleon still has a ton of MP. Alright, we're here to see Quark. Yep, we are quite stronger. And we brought Galleon. Ah, 15. So it's been 15 years since the last, uh... Dragon Master. Thank you for that tidbit. A child born that day? What are you talking about? Yeah, I mean, we do have the Vile Tribe running around, but is it... Are they that dangerous? Well, I mean, they were trying to do something with Luna, or... They were trying to find some singer. So they do have, uh... They do have something they're plotting. Luna is the one, huh? Uh, I don't like where this is going. This scene is just epic. Not Galleon, dear Quark. Magic Emperor Galleon. Magic Emperor Galleon? Magic Emperor? Galleon. Oh, that's not good.
shall be the cornerstone of a new order. My world order. But... <laughs> who shall be my queen? Oh my. Business just picked up. Dang, he is not joking around. He is really not joking around. Well, things just got really, really bad. And I'm going to dissect this more in the next part. How did we get back here? Well, that will also be answered in the next part.